back everyone so summer is finally over uh, where I live is very touristy so it's been hectic for the last few months but it's finally quieted it down now and it gives me more time to get in and do some VR videos so uh, thanks for tuning in let's get cracking on red light green light So these are the games that I've been playing over the last few days red and light. we are going to start with the red light green light game on SideQuest. This is currently free, there are two versions, um, one by a different developer which is slightly different and is a little bit more kind of related to the Squid Games which are popular on Netflix at the moment. Uh, this is a much more basic version but it is free and it's alright, it's quite good. Um, it does get a little bit repetitive after a while, there's not really much to Red do, light. you just literally run to the other side um, and it gets progressively harder. But if you are a big fan green of the Squid light. Games and you've never played this game, Red Light and Green Light, then uh, yeah, Red give it a go. It's a good little crack on. Uh, yeah, awesome. Green light. And it's free, obviously, to download from SideQuest now. Red light. Next up, just in time for Halloween, is Voodoo People. So this is an early demo, it's a free demo though, um, but it shows promise, it shows what it can be, and if you're kind of into that horror theme, then this is kind of a perfect little game to get you into those little Halloween vibes. The demo is relatively easy, but the controls are good and the graphics are great and it just shows what potential this game has. So get this for free now from SideQuest. Next up we have Shuriken VR. And in all honesty, I wanted to like this game, but I didn't. Um, the graphics are good, they've got those uh, classic polygon based graphics. Um, the gameplay is pretty smooth, um, but the, the fighting system where you have to throw the shurikens, you know, once you've done the trade, you kind of get the grasp of it. But it just, it, by, a, by about the third level, my wrist ached. <laughs> by the next day, I was walking around like a T Rex because I'd strained them so much. Um, they physically hurt. I just wanted this game to have a little bit more. I would have preferred that if the shuriken was uh, a primary weapon and you maybe had a secondary weapon like a sword that you could just literally cut these people down and I found also that if you ended up just walking in circles throwing shuriken it just became a little bit repetitive. Um, so it, it does have promise and it's a good little game to download just to see the demo um, but I think the throwing system is a little bit but it'll be interesting to see whether it's worth downloading and it's free on SideQuest now. So next up we have Cho Jin Ryu or Cho Jin Ryu, who knows. Um, unfortunately this game is all in uh, Chinese or Korean or a Asian language which I don't understand. Um, I don't really know what the controls are and I'm not even sure what it's supposed to do. But in terms of something cool to see, it's well worth it. So you are a bird of prey and you fly off your perch and I assume that you're going to kill stuff, but I'm not sure. But this is definitely worth checking out, even though we don't know what the hell you're supposed to be doing. Free on side quest now. <laughs> so.
So finally we have by far my favourite game of the week and is the one that I highly recommend to download. In space no one can hear you click. This is a great little platformer with some really really cool soundscapes, uh, really great visuals and it's just a fun little game to play. Um, you'll find that you start doing the levels and they get more complex and I haven't finished it yet but this is definitely my favourite game of the week. It just kind of reminded me of those uh, retro platformers that we used to play uh, when we were younger. So, well worth downloading and give the developer some love. Great, go download it now. Right, thanks for watching everyone, that's it for this week, uh, hopefully next week I'll have another video with some of the newer games that are coming out, it looks like there's some cool little games coming out over the next few days uh, that'll be worth checking out. Please consider subscribing to the channel, any comments or any games you think I've missed, just chuck them in the comment section below and have an awesome week, thanks very much, cheers, bye.